When a flood or water disaster is on the way, time is of the essence. And the last thing that you want to be doing is shoveling sand. Traditional sandbags require back-breaking labor, and you need to be strong and fit in order to do so. But what if I told you there was a much easier way? That you and you alone can build a barrier wall in minutes with almost no labor, no shoveling, and zero sand. This small box right here has 25 storm bags in it. It weighs less than a single sandbag. And inside is the equivalent of over 500 pounds of sand. Inside the box, you're gonna find 25 bags that look just like this. This is the storm bag. It looks and feels just like an empty sandbag, except it's got a special polymer on the inside that will absorb between four and five gallons of water, turning this one pound bag into a fully usable 35 pound sandbag, but with no sand at all. To deploy the storm bag, all you have to do is add water. So what I'm gonna do is fill this wheelbarrow with a little bit of water and submerge the storm bags. In just three to five minutes, each bag is going to expand to its fully usable size. To get the storm bag from this state to a fully hydrated 35 pound bag, all you need to do is add some water. You can either take this storm bag and place it down in a line, run a hose over it or let the rain hit it, or to make things a little quicker, you can submerge the bags in some water. What I have here is a wheelbarrow. Most homes you can find a wheelbarrow or a bucket or some sort of a trough, maybe even a bathtub. But submerging the bags is the fastest way to get them to expand to their full size. Like I said, each bag will absorb four to five gallons of water. So these can also be used to soak up spills. Let's say you've got a leak in your basement, you've got a broken faucet in your kitchen, you throw down a few bags, each one will swell up and absorb four to five gallons of water, cleaning up your mess for you and allowing you to take some time to go figure out how to shut off the water. Now you might be thinking to yourself, I can shovel pretty fast. It doesn't take three to five minutes to fill up a sandbag. Well, the nice thing about a storm bag is, in a situation like this, you can fill up more than one at the same time. So what I'm gonna do is put a few different storm bags in here and let them do their magic all on their own. Now all we have to do is wait. One of the best things about the storm bag is that it's reusable. Each storm bag can be reused three to five times. Now that depends on the conditions that they're used in. Of course, if they get contaminated with something dirty, floodwaters are always different, you might not want to reuse them. But in perfect conditions, with just water, they can be reused many times. After just a few minutes, each storm bag, starting out just like this, turns into a fully deployable 35-pound storm bag.